We're at the Construction Expo with Citroën Dava from Mercedes-Benz Surrey. How are you today? Fine, thank you. Very good. So you've got a very nice, um, a very nice exhibit here. Tell us about how the exposure has been at this exhibit today. It's very encouraging and very nice. Uh, I think uh, um, it's going to be a very good um, exhibition here, show, and uh, um, we're going to get some more uh, customers here. Well, Mercedes, I mean, it's an amazing product, so, and it's very good to meet you. And if you do need a vehicle, you got to see Sucha Randava at Mercedes-Benz Surrey. Yeah. Mercedes-Benz, nothing but the best. Nothing but the best. You heard it here, Sucha Randava. All right. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Ken and Leroy from l and &L Renovations. How are you guys doing today? We're good. Yeah? Good, yeah. How is the reception with the Expo so far? Good. Now that people don't think we're selling just the signs anymore, it's, it's going good. <laughs> <laughs> now that they know the business. Speaking of that, maybe you can tell our viewers what your business is so they don't think you're selling signs. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, we're a general contractor. We do mainly home renovations. Uh, we do some commercial contracting as well. Um, but anything from inside and outside your house, we can fix, change, whatever you want to do. Very good. And Ken, what areas of the Lower Mainland do you service? Langley, Surrey, Delta. We don't tend to go across to Vancouver very often. Okay. But you must have a lot of business just in this area alone. There's so it's much development. Yeah. 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 There's lots going on out here, so. Okay. So uh, you're also here tomorrow? Yes. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. So have a great time and good luck to you both. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thanks. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Kevin Aujla and Nadim from BC Builder. How are you guys? Very good. Good. How are you doing? Good. Great. It's amazing. So can you tell me a bit about what BC Builder is? Yeah, we're actually an online construction platform connecting home builders and subcontractors together. Uh, so we have a 40-step process, the home building process, and uh, the new construction guys, the new home builders, they can upload the construction project that they're working on right now, and uh, subcontractors can go onto our website, find those leads, and contact those home builders and get in touch, and hopefully they can do some business together. Okay, so you're kind of uh, making them kind of meet in a maybe in a legitimate type of way so that everything is on the up and up? Yes, that's correct. The software is a paid-for service by the contractors. Uh, builders put projects on there, right, that subcontractors can put a bid on. So what we're guaranteeing is jobs, jobs for a lot of the subcontractors, right, which puts a lot of power into a subcontractor's hands. So subcontractors, including electricians, plumbers, uh, you know, whatever it is under any, yeah. all the tradesmen, under, any, anything underneath the sun. Yeah. So then with this type of service, would that expedite, say, a project maybe compared to what it would be before? Like sometimes things can drag on for a long time. Would this be one of the benefits of your company? Yes, absolutely. Um, when, when a home builder is getting contractors through our website, yeah. uh, they're assured that they're not going to be leaving the site halfway through. Uh, if they are, they get one complaint, two complaints, and then they will be removed from the website. Um, so that is a little bit of a service that we provide there. Um, so they can assure quality assurance there. So it's a bit of protection for the consumer and the, and the builders as well. That's very cool. So what do you feel um, with this expo? Has it been great exposure for you guys? How are the people receiving your company? Uh, yeah, it's been a great, great experience. Lots of people coming through, uh, lots of forums filled out. So it's been uh, a, a great experience for us. That's wonderful. And this is your first year doing it? Uh, yes, yes, absolutely. Very good to meet you, Nadim and Kevin. Good luck to you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Sunil Joshi from Shivam Enterprise. Sunil, how are you? Very good. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. How is the Expo going so far today? So far, it's very exciting and I'm very glad that we are launching this product and hopefully we will be doing much better in Vancouver. Very good. Can you tell me a bit about your company, when you started, what you have, your products, that kind of thing? Yeah, I had a dream to do my passions and uh, wanted to have the market love their passion and cultivated a lot of designs back home in India uh, before 20 years and uh, started this railing manufacturing business, which is still running so good and we have evolved in the materials and uh, excel in the quality as an international and uh, we are meeting the ISO standards 
launching in Vancouver now for the very first time and very excited that we will be not only just competing with the local market, but we will be having a very good market to work with. Yes, it's a booming market for sure. So that's great, Sunil. Thank you so much. And what have you noticed? Uh, people are asking you about your product. What is the most, uh, the reception that you're getting from them? They really love it. And I found out that they are tired of the conventional items. And this is a new concept to them. And compared to the prices or the quality in the market or the practices they have from other countries, they are very, very welcoming that concept that you have this made in India, which is really, really making proud to me that, yes, it is. Very good. Best of luck to you, Sunil. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. We are at the Construction Expo with Johnny Gosel, CC Equipment. How are you doing, Johnny? I'm doing great. How are you doing? I'm good. Can you tell us a bit about your business? Uh, so we're the distributor for Wacker Noisen. Uh, as you can see, we have a bunch of construction equipment here. Uh, we're the dealer for BC as of now, and we sell anything from compactors, power generation, to construction. Oh, man. That's okay. <laughs> okay, so you sell all of the equipment, and what else What else do you do? Uh, we also do some rentals and stuff like that, but mostly it's for, you know, rent, rentals is mostly for demos and stuff like that we do, and, uh, but, yeah. What area do you service? We service the Lower Mainland. Uh, we do Vancouver Island and some of the Okanagan. And how many years have you been in business? Uh, we've been in business since 2007. Very good. So a substantial amount of time. That's very good. So this expo, what do you think it's, um, how is it going? Do you feel like it's helping you out? What's the reception so far by the people that come and visit your booth? Um, first, I was a little bit hesitant about the expo, but, you know, it's actually turned out pretty good. I really, really like it. It's, uh, you know, good turnout. Uh, and... Yeah, it's great new contacts and stuff like that. So I think, yeah, it's had a good turnout. That's awesome, Johnny. Best of luck to you. You're here again tomorrow, right? Yeah. 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 Thank you so much, Johnny. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. for having us. Han Jesse Construction Expo de Jesse Noor Dinal Galkarreya. Noor, how are you? Matika to see dosto. Asi bhi theek hai. Asi Noor Dinal Galkarreya karke na the business hai ki super tech designs. Thwaadi business to see sanu thoda je apni business baare dosto. ਅਸੀਂ ਵੁਡਨ ਰੇਲਿੰਗਸ ਦਾ ਕੰਮ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਐਂਡ ਅਸੀਂ ਮੈਨੂਫੈਕਚਰ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਇੰਸਟਾਲ ਵੀ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਔਰ ਸਾਡੇ ਕੋਲ ਜਿਹੜੀਆਂ ਵੁਡਨਸ ਹੈਗੀਆਂ ਪੋਪੂਲਰ ਮੇਪਲ ਐਂਡ ਓਕ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸੀਂ ਪ੍ਰੋਵਾਈਡ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਓਨਲੀ ਇਨਸਾਈਡ ਰੇਲਿੰਗ ਦਾ ਅਸੀਂ ਕੰਮ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਸੋ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਘਰਾਂ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਅੰਦਰ ਲੱਗਦੀ ਆ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਕਿਹੜੀ ਜਗ੍ਹਾ ਸਰਵਿਸ ਕਰਦੇ ਲਾਈਕ ਸਰੀ ਲੈਂਗਲੀ ਕਿੱਥੇ ਸਿਰਫ ਸਰੀ ਕਲੈਂਗਲੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਵੀ ਸਰੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਸਾਡਾ ਆਫਿਸ ਤੇ ਹੈਗਾ ਆ ਉੱਥੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਮੈਨੂਫੈਕਚਰ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਔਰ ਬਾਕੀ ਜਗ੍ਹਾ ਤੇ ਵੀ ਮਤਲਬ ਸਮਾਨ ਜਾਂਦਾ ਆ ਡਿਲੀਵਰ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਅਸੀਂ ਉੱਥੇ ਵੀ ਸੋ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਕੰਪਨੀ ਹੈ ਉੱਥੇ ਜਿਹ ਦਾ ਕਸਟਮਰਸ ਆ ਸਕਦੇ ਕਿ ਸਿਰਫ ਬਿਲਡਰਸ ਆ ਸਕਦੇ ਆ ਕਸਟਮਰਸ ਔਰ ਬਿਲਡਰਸ ਬੋਥ ਕੈਨ ਕਮ ਹੀਅਰ ਹੋਸਲ ਤੇ ਰੀਟੇਲ ਦੋਨੇ ਵੈਰੀ ਗੁੱਡ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਐਕਸਪੋ ਕਿੱਦਾਂ ਲੱਗ ਰਿਹਾ ਐਕਸਪੋ ਬਹੁਤ ਵਧੀਆ ਆ ਸਾਰੇ ਲੋਕ ਇੱਥੇ ਆ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਸਾਡੇ ਪ੍ਰੋਡਕਟ ਦੀ ਪ੍ਰੋਮੋਸ਼ਨ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਆ ਐਂਡ ਸਾਰੇ ਦੇਖਦੇ ਆ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਪਤਾ ਲੱਗਦਾ ਆ ਐਂਡ ਕਈ ਬਿਲਡਰਸ ਵੀ ਜਿੱਦਾਂ ਆਏ ਆ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਕੰਟਰੈਕਟ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਆ ਦੇ ਕੈਨ ਬਾਈ ਫਰਮ ਅਸ ਸੋ ਆਪਰਚੁਨਿਟੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਇੱਥੇ ਹੈ ਨਾ ਓਕੇ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਸੋ ਮਚ ਨੂਰ ਗੁੱਡ ਲੱਕ ਟੂ ਯੂ ਓਕੇ ਬਾਈ I'm here at the Construction Expo with Jeanette Martin. How are you, Jeanette? I'm fantastic. How are you? I'm doing well. Jeanette is with BCFCA. Can you tell us what that is? Okay, the acronym stands for the BC Floor Covering Association. We've been around since 1959, and we're the governing body for the flooring industry, everything except tile. So when it comes to your hardwood floor, laminate, vinyl plank, LVT, luxury, uh, luxury vinyl, uh, carpeting, we provide the education and we are the governing body. So if a consumer has a question or if a hardwood floor company has a question, we're definitely where you want to be part of. Very good. How is the expo as far as reception from the visitors that come and see you? Uh, it's been great. To me, it's you pull the people in and ask them why they're here and find out uh, what they want to learn. That's our job when you're in a trade show is to make sure you're seen and make sure your standards are being seen. Very good. It's such a pleasure to meet you, Jeanette. And you're very cool, so I think we're going to pound it out. Burger and fries. <laughs> Thanks, Jeanette. You're welcome. I'm at the Construction Expo with Asif Qureshi with Fenevo Lending. Asif, how is this uh, expo going so far for you? This is excellent. This is awesome. We have a lot of people come out here today. Uh, I was not expecting, so that was quite a surprise. And it's going great. So if you can tell us a bit about your business so that our viewers can learn what it is that you do. 
Yeah, absolutely. We do all kinds of mortgage-based lending. So if uh, anybody is looking for construction mortgage, residential mortgage, uh, development, land assembly, any type of mortgage, uh, we can help them with that. If somebody is putting together a high-rise project or is a townhouse project or multiple residential homes, so we can help them with the lending side. Very good. And at this expo, what have you noticed uh, maybe people are inquiring about or they're interested in? You know, I've seen a lot of builders and um, developers come here yeah. and basically they're looking for, um, you know, ways to support their projects, whether it's on the lending side or the product side, you know, that's what they're interested in. And so that makes itself quite a success. Right, so when they come and see you, they've come to the right place then? Pretty much, yes, huh. absolutely. The main thing is this particular show is geared towards a specific market, which is construction and development and building, right? And so we have put together here a group of all the trades and everything to support that industry. And of course, those are the people that are coming here. Works out perfectly, yeah. It it's a pleasure to talk to you and you're here again tomorrow. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. We're at the Construction Expo talking to John from Azac Company. John, how's it going today? Really good. So this is giving uh, the community a lot of exposure with the local businesses that's going on. How do you feel it's going so far as far as exposure for your company? Well, we've had a busy day, so it's been very steady. Uh, pleased with the results. This is our first year here, and we'll definitely be coming back. Very good. So can you tell us about your business so that our viewers know exactly what it is that you do? Sure. So we do uh, composite products primarily, uh, PVC composite decking and trim. We do recycled uh, pavers made with 75% truck tires. And we do wood composite under the brand name of TimberTech. Very good. So it's like the kind of like the vinyl siding on houses type of thing? Uh, not quite. Ours has a very high recycled content. Uh, other vinyl products uh, wouldn't have that. Uh, so we have a very high green value to our products. Well, that's very good to know that you're conscious about that. Right. So thank you so much, John, and you're here again tomorrow? Yes. Very good. Thank you so much. You. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Andy Graywall from Dick's Lumber. Andy, how are you? Good. How are you? I'm doing very well. How is the expo going as far as reception from the people here at today? It's been really busy today, especially in the morning. We had a big crowd. Yeah. Now it's kind of slowing down, but it makes sense, right? Yeah, well, you're here for two days, so you're here today and tomorrow. Can you tell our viewers about Dick's Lumber? Dick's Lumber is the biggest lumber yard in the industry. We have over five locations, three serving lumbers and two manufacturing industries. So, yeah. Where are they located? Uh, we have one in North Vancouver, one in Burnaby, one in Surrey, one in Port Kells, and that's it. Wow, that's uh, how, how many years has Dick's Lumber been around? Because if you've got that much uh, locations, it's probably been around for a long time. Yep, it's been in the industry for over 50 years. I would say 55. So it was around before your time then. <laughs> awesome. Thanks so much, Andy. Yeah. And uh, best of luck tomorrow as well. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey there, I'm Dora Cola. And I'm Caitlin, and we're from B&B &B Trust today. Here at the Construction Expo, we are showing off all of our super cool trusses. So right now what's really, really popular, what a lot of people are getting are the curved and arched trusses, as you can see over there. I don't More know if modern right. design, if you guys are looking to step your game up to build a home and make it more modern and, you know, something different. We also have the traditional triangle trusses, but yeah. Shout out to everyone that we met today. Thank you so much for coming out. And uh, hi to everyone that couldn't make it. We'll see you next year. Thank you guys for coming down. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Karambir Singh from SunTech Solar. Karambir, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm very good. Tell us about your technology with SunTech Solar. Um, you know, it's a new technology. People are uh, looking into it day by day. And it's improving as well. And uh, now from the last year, we started last year. And uh, from the last year, now people are more interested in solar and they want to have the future homes. So we are here uh, providing them the opportunity to have their future homes and we explain them everything regarding like how this works and uh, how it helps you to save your energy bills. Yeah. I've heard that you can save quite a bit of money by using the solar instead of the solar energy instead. Yes, you can save a lot of money. It depends like how much you want to offset. You can offset 50%, 75%, and you can go a net zero as well. It depends on like how big system you are looking for on the house and what's your consumption. According to that, we analyze as well, and uh, we can come over to your place, and we can see how big system we can install, how much you want to install, and how much you want to invest in that, right? right. Yeah. 
So you pretty much do whatever the customer needs and your uh, your customer service is exceptional, I've heard. Yes. Yeah, yeah that's we try our level best so that they can uh, like tell other people as well that uh, what it is and uh, you should look into it. Now we have installed a few houses and from them we get like two, three references because they like it and their bills are going down. So they are uh, like telling other people to have that in their houses, right? Yeah. That's wonderful. Karambir, thank you so much and good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Honorable Harry Baines, Labour Minister. How are you today? I'm very good. I'm so excited to see uh, the construction uh, community getting together under one roof, uh, trying to uh, show off uh, what they have to offer in uh, new trends and new applications. It's so beautiful uh, right here in Surrey. It is wonderful, and Surrey is booming, obviously, and it's really good to have a show like this to showcase the different technologies that are coming about. Have you seen anything that kind of surprised you or interested you in any way? Well, Surrey has um, has a has a let the I think country in in construction and construction industry, especially in residential, and all the new technologies uh, in applications and uh, and how we make our homes more efficient and with with a new material, new new technology. As I said, I think it's it's amazing, and and I'm so happy to see WorkSafe uh, also here. Because my one of the, my my key goal is to to make work safe uh, workplaces in British Columbia the safest in the country, because every worker expect and their families expect the worker that go to work comes home in the same shape that they went in, and uh, the safe safe uh, uh, operations are usually efficient and uh, more productive operations. So I think that's my goal, and I, I I'm happy that the work safe is here to get that message out, and uh, we want to make sure that uh, our workplaces are safe. I like that message, safety first, for sure. It's always really good to talk to you. Is there anything else you want to leave our viewers with right now? I just want to say, uh, I want to say thank you to the organizers uh, of Construction Expo, uh, Mr. Sharma, uh, bringing uh, different uh, uh, you know, um, people involved in the construction industry together under one roof, south of the Fraser. Yeah. Many of these folks uh, don't get to go to Vancouver with the Vancouver uh, trade shows. So here we are, um, showcasing uh, our ability to to the world that uh, we can actually uh, we are, we're doing very good and one of the thing uh, that really interested me was uh, Durodeck they said you know they're not exposed to uh, people here in, in south of the Fraser uh, and then especially they're not exposed to uh, people in South Asian community mm -hmm. and so they're here I think you know this is one of the one of the key example how we can uh, uh, showcase what we have uh, in new technology and a new way of uh, building our homes and uh, because construction industry is is the key to our, our economic growth and it's it's going to continue to be and my other message to uh, many people who are taking courses here is the affordability yeah. uh, lower mainland has become unaffordable for a younger generation That's and true. I think what opportunity my generation had yeah. uh, we want to make sure that the next generation also have the same uh, same opportunity to own a home Yes. Uh, the dream of owning a home uh, uh, almost has slipped away from their hands right now. We want to make sure that uh, that dream is realized in the in 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 near future. And right now, they're even dreaming to even even rent. So I think uh, I think things are really really bad, and we want to make sure that uh, we work towards a solution where our younger generation uh, uh, dream of uh, owning a home uh, comes true. Uh, you know, in a short while. Yeah, I totally agree with you. That's very good. Thank you so much. Um, anyways, enjoy the expo, and it's always good to talk to you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I want to thank you very much for seeing all of us in BC, which is a new government. It's been a long time ago, and the affordability and making people's life more affordable is one of our keys. So we need to improve it. Uh, already come ho chuka you know just tolls khatam ho gaye msp premium khatam ho rahi hai te assi oh industry jis tarah ki industry hai ya oh ji economy create karna chahunde ha jide naal sare british economy nu fayda hove na ke sirf top 2% nu so i think uh, assi already on our way uh, i think uh, coming days you'll see uh, uh, much more uh, from this government and i'm so happy to be part of that government thank you very much thank you so much thank you I'm here at the Construction Expo with Thomas from Eskel Nazo. How are you, Thomas? I'm doing fine, thank you. Very good. Can you tell us a bit about your business? Sure. We are a molding company that provides staining to help finish your flooring projects. So most flooring companies provide the floor and nothing else. So we try to help with all the little accessories to finish the job. How long have you been in business? Our company's been in business for about uh, 12 years, and we've been specializing in this for the last two. And what areas do you service? 
Uh, we service the uh, entire Lower Mainland. We actually have customers in Victoria. We have customers in Calgary. We even did a big project in Hawaii once. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be the place I'd want to do a project. <laughs> yes, yes. All right, great. And how is the reception at the expo so far? Uh, it's pretty good. We've got quite a few people that have been coming in, and it's nice that it's focused directly at the trades, so we're uh, hitting our target market. That's wonderful. Good luck to you, Thomas. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I'm at the Construction Expo with Jazz Hundle and Clavinder Hundle of Fair Deal Carpets. How are you today? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Clavinder, how are you? I'm fine. Thanks. So how is the Expo going so far for you? So far it's good. We were here all day yesterday and it was really good. It was a lot of response. I think it's a good idea. To so, here. yeah, it is a good, uh, good thing to do every year. It's great exposure for you. So tell me a bit about your business, how many years you've been here and what areas you service? Yeah, we service from uh, Kelowna to Whistler. So I'm in this business been 20 years. So, wow. so far it's really good and we're doing very well. So what types of new, maybe new technology or some sort of carpeting that maybe you want to tell our viewers? Something interesting, different than the norm. Yes, maybe you could tell we them. We have uh, new carpet lines came in, because which is uh, made by the Polytech. So it's uh, better than the nylon and the polyester carpet. And we have a new product came in. It's um, Vinyl planks, okay. which is, um, you can just glue it down. We don't need to, it's a peel and glue down. So new product came in, it's a vinyl planks. Okay. So it's a waterproof. And uh, we got more vinyl planks came in. They're like uh, waterproof and also it's good for your feet and for your backing. So I guess the advantage to something that's vinyl is that it's not going to, uh, I guess, deteriorate. Like wood kind of deteriorates yeah. and laminate deteriorates. Yeah. But the vinyl looks authentic, authentic yes. but very good. Okay, well, thank you so much, no and problem. best of luck to you at the expo. Thank yeah, you. Thank you. No problem. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Corey Merigway of North Shore Home Services. Corey, how are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? I'm doing very well. So I see behind me this filthy gutter. Can you tell me about North, uh, can you tell me about North Shore Home Services and what you guys do? Yeah, absolutely. So North Shore Home Services, we're... Two companies. Well, we have two sections of our company. We have an installation crew and we have a general maintenance crew. Okay. So we service gutter cleaning, window cleaning, moss removal, and power washing on any exterior houses in the lower mainland and North Shore. And then we also do installation of gutters. So we do the traditional way and we also do with screening system as well. It's a heavy fastening system that also serves as a self-cleaning system. So I know this is terrible of me, but I... I would never want to clean my gutters. Why do I have to clean them at all? Yeah, well, that's a good question. So over time, a lot of material gets caught up in your gutters, right? Okay. Some people are more fortunate than others. They don't have a lot of debris coming down to their gutters. Yeah. Some people do have a lot of stuff coming down. If you don't maintain your gutters, it's going to start falling out of the fascia board on your house, which will in turn lead to a lot of leaking and damage on the exterior of the house. So it's good to get regular maintenance once or twice a year, depending on your area. Either you going up there and cleaning yourself or calling people like North Shore Home Services that will go up and take care of that situation for you. Well, I think I would call you because I definitely don't want to do it. Yeah, no problem. And how's the, uh, the reception here at the Expo? How do you feel people are liking your company? What's going on? Like, what do you feel? Yeah, the Expo's been good. A lot of questions and we've been doing a lot of talking for the installation of the gutters and a lot of uh, general maintenance as well. So it's been going really good. That's excellent. Thank you so much, Corey. Thank you very much. I'm at the Construction Expo with Mike Patterson of Ultimate Shower Systems. Mike, how are you? Uh, fantastic. Thanks for asking. Very good. Tell us about your business. All right. Well, Ultimate Showers uh, is a business that does the uh, um, waterproofing systems uh, for showers. So we manufacture XPS board, which is put into the shower system with membranes. And we can custom manufacture any size shower that people need and make sure it's 100% waterproof. That's very good. Uh, where do you service? What's, uh, what areas do you service? Surrey, Langley? Yeah, well, we're based out of Abbotsford, okay. and, but we'll service uh, the whole lower mainland, so there's nowhere that we won't go. Uh, yeah, so just feel free to reach out to us. We'll come. Awesome. And how many years have you been in business? Well, we've been 16 years through our parent company, and this is actually a new launch for this product for us, okay. so a year and a half. What is the other company? Uh, Propac Contracting and Design. So is that like interior design then? Yeah, we do interior design through full renovation. Okay. So this was a business that was started uh, kind of to keep the kids busy and out of my hair. 
Oh, that's good. I like that. And how is the expo going for you so far? How is the reception from the the people that are here? Good. We've done a couple uh, shows this year, and this is an excellent show because it seems to be that the people that are asking the questions are really engaging. So, so it's good. Yeah. So not a lot of looky lose, but actually people that are actually interested in the product and might actually be a potential customer. Love it. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you so much. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you. I'm here with Oscar from Mainland Ford. Oscar, how are you? Really good. Thank you. Very good. So far at this expo, how has the reception been by the people that come and visit you? Well, it's really good, actually. It's, we start, well, for me, in personal, it's my first day. Yesterday I was in the dealership, but it been, started being busy. Okay. A lot of people asking questions about our products, so it's really good. First time, good. So, Mainland Ford, tell us about Mainland Ford, whatever you want our viewers to know. Okay, Mainland Ford is a dealership in Surrey, one of the three Fords in Surrey. But our dealership is in 104 and 144. Yeah. It's a really good, great, great dealership. A new, new, it's a lot of stuff new. So actually me, I'm a sales guy, uh, new in the, deal, in the business. So yeah. it's been a really great place to work. Do you know how many years Mainland Ford has been in business? Well, Mainland Ford, with, like Mainland Ford, yeah. is two years. Okay. But we part of our group, a stack group. Yeah. So the owners have nine dealerships. So I've been in the market for more than 24, five years. So. so a lot of experience. We'll be taken care of if we come visit Mainland Ford. Claro, claro, please. Come. Thank you so much. And I can also say to you, muchas gracias. De nada. Uh, Vengan. <laughs> good to talk to you, Oscar. Thank, thank you so you. much. I'm here with Amber Noakes of Barter First. Amber, how are you? I'm great, thank you. Very good. So this expo, how has it been so far as far as reception from the people that come and visit your booth? It's really great. I mean, it's a good way for us to connect with more people in the trades, and uh, we've made some really good connections. So Barter First, what, what is Barter First? What we do is we help companies trade their goods and services so they don't have to use cash when they want to buy things to build their business. So say a company's new, they're looking to get a website done or do some marketing, they can trade what they offer for the things that they need. Very good. And how many years have you been doing uh, this barter first? We've been doing it for 20 years now. And what areas do you mainly deal? Is it all over North America or where is it? We're locally based and we have affiliates in different cities. So our main focus is the lower mainland. And we work with all different types of businesses. So everything from tradespeople to uh, restaurants to hotels to service providers. It's probably a good service. Sometimes you don't have the capital that you need and you can do the barter first. So that's great. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Amelia from Rock Wool Stone Wool Insulation. Amelia, what is this? What is going on right here? So what you're seeing here is our non-combustible uh, stone wool insulation. The product that I'm depicting here is called um, our uh, Safe and Sound. Okay. So it's both used for sound mitigation as well as uh, fire. So what I'm depicting here is the fact that that is uh, a non-combustible product. Yeah. And so... Um, it's really not doing anything. It's just, it's just going, but nothing's actually... No. It, yeah. There is, uh, you're not going to see any flames. It will not burn. At 1170 um, uh, degrees Celsius, yeah. it will melt because it is made from uh, basalt rock, which is, which is a lava rock. And we also um, um, use a slag product as well. Okay. We combine those two products, we melt it, spin it um, like yeah. cotton candy, add a little bit of binder, some oil to make it um, uh, water repellent, yeah. and um, you have your insulation product. That's amazing. So who are your customers? Who can, who can purchase your products? Pretty well everybody. We are um, very prominent in the commercial industry, so you see product. So the product that you're going to show us, yeah, just come a little closer here. On the commercial side, you okay. see uh, our cavity rock product in the high-rise building. So you know it's very prominent there. Okay. But here, what we are also uh, promoting is to our residential uh, community with the new uh, BC Energy Step Code. You know there are some yes. changes coming in, and yeah. so there are going to be new assemblies, uh, wall assemblies for the residential market Part Nine right. uh, that. Um, uh, our builders are going to need to learn about. So I'm just kind of here to talk about the various types of options that they have uh, to, um, uh, to build their new homes with various types of wall assemblies. So we at Rockwall are trying to help our customers both on the residential, commercial, roofing, uh, industrial side. And yeah. so 
Thank you so much, Amelia. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Praveen from Geospace Consulting. How are you today? I'm fine. Very good. And we're also here with Neelam. How are you? I am good. Thank you. Very good. Tell me about your Geospace Consulting business, please. In Geospace, uh, basically, we, we are designing houses, a custom home designs and a structure engineering on a one platform. And our forte is that we can, we can serve the customers as a one-stop shop for all of their construction design needs. And it's a two-stage, basically pre-construction stage, they need an architecture plan and a structure designs. So we do both. And both the houses are designed by me and they have a different feel and look. And we sold that house within four weeks, so that's, that's a plus point for the house. Like we design as per the customer requirements. And like we, we, we are not having a stock plans with us. We try to like accommodate the client's requirement wish list and we design as per the requirements, as per the markets, and we gave some, some our, our inputs from our side that what will be good for that particular market. So, so that's, you, that's a major, major focus. So you customize it and make it unique for specific, yes. each specific customer? Always. That's very good. Always. And how many years have you been in business? I'm in this business for three years, but for a long time, like for last 20 years, I'm designing different, different things. I was designing a pavilions and Hone pavilions and Aisha pavilions. Right. So I worked in Dubai as well. So it's a long time so for lots, this business. Yeah. Lots of experience. Lots then. of experience for that. Very good. Very good to meet you. And Neelam, you also have a business that you do in, in addition to this. Yes. Okay. Tell us about your business, so the name of your business and what you do. Yeah. My name of my business is Neelam Bansal Incorporation, and I'm a CPA, CGA. Um, so I, um, I'm in business for last almost 15 years here in Surrey, and uh, I do all type of taxes, which is personal, self-employment, and company taxes. And my specialization is uh, tax planning, um, uh, which is not, which is way over and above the doing the normal accounting. So um, and uh, you know setting up the new companies and also the uh, trucking and construction people specializing in their accounts also. Very good. So if someone wanted to contact you, Neelam, they could speak to you as well at Geospace Consulting. Yeah. yeah. How's the expo going so far as far as the reception from the people here? Fantastic. Yeah. Uh, we are getting very good response and people are visiting. They are very keen and uh, sincere to know what we do. So it's a great, a great platform to be here. Yeah, it's just a great platform and I can say that people are visiting and they want to see our services and then yeah. They, they want to, like, they have like, yeah. new things, new concepts in their minds. Yeah. And we, 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 we want their dream to be on the paper and it should go to a city and then we can, we can bring everything on the paper. So you're making dreams come true then? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I want to thank you the organizers for giving us this opportunity to be here and yeah. to be interviewed by you. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much, Neelam. Good to meet thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm here at the Construction Expo with Kelsey from Mira Flores. Kelsey, how are you? Great, thanks. Very good. So far at this expo, how has the reception been from all of the people visiting your booth? Everybody has just been so so nice, lots of interest in various uh, products in vinyl plank, um, the shag carpet over there in particular still garners a lot of interest. People like that for area rugs. Yeah. Maybe shag carpet's back? Is that everything retro comes back eventually? Only in small doses though, area rugs, not full rooms anymore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how many years has Mira Flores been in business? Actually, we're celebrating our 15th anniversary this year. 15th? Yes. One five. One five yes. Wow, that's amazing. What areas do you service? Uh, so our main showroom is in Surrey, uh, but we have mobile showrooms that service the whole lower mainland. Okay, so any, any of the lower mainland can be a potential exactly, client for yeah. you? We have, the showrooms that, we have showrooms that come to the customers, so that way they can view flooring samples in their own home, in their own light, at their own convenience. That makes it very convenient, exactly. Well, thank you so much, Kelsey. Best of luck to you. Thank you so much. You. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Clay from Save Your Canada. Clay, how are you? I'm wonderful, how are you? I'm doing very well. Tell us about your products and your company. So we specialize in heated apparel uh, and in the summertime we have cooling products, so cooling towels, cooling t-shirts, uh, full range. Okay, how many years have you been in business? Uh, this will be our sixth year in the cooling business and our third year in the heating business. It's very cool because in the winter, you know, I'm, I'm freezing and in the summer I'm too hot. So this, so, this might be my, my answer. Yeah, we've got stuff for everybody. <laughs> yeah, so can you tell us about the reception so far at the Expo? How has it been? Pretty good. Like yeah. uh, a lot of guys working outside winter and summertime. So the cooling towels go well. And obviously the heated gloves for the winter, the guys love it. 
Yeah, absolutely. Construction can definitely benefit from that for sure. I was thinking about myself, but yes, construction would make way more sense. Yeah. Can you tell me about a product maybe that our viewers would like to see something that will just kind of maybe give them an idea of what your products yeah, do? I can show them, uh, I guess, one for hot and one for cold. Sure. We'll start with the, what you need for the cold. Sure. Uh, inside here, we have okay. a heated glove liner. So basically a glove to make all gloves heated. Okay. Uh, you'll get three temperature settings. You get high, medium, and low. Okay. Brings it from 70, 60 to 50 degrees Celsius. Oh, wow. Uh, of course, That's rechargeable cool. lithium ion batteries here. Yeah. Do you want to try one on? Uh, it's okay. okay. It's okay just because we don't have a ton of time, okay. but we can do this again later. Yeah. So, okay, perfect. And then show me... Show me the other product. So for the cooling, uh, it's a material. Uh, it's basically 100% polyester. It's just a special way that it's woven. Okay. Uh, you soak this material in water. Even hot water will work. You wring it out and shake it. Five, okay. ten seconds like this. Yeah. And I'll just show you on your forearm. Okay. So, you can just pull up my sleeve for me. Thank even you. Even okay, if it's that's plus good. 30, plus 40. Yeah. Tie it anywhere on oh, your wow. body. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> And uh, they'll stay cold. That's amazing. For, yeah, six That's to eight very hours. cold. I can actually hang on to that yeah. for a bit. I'm so warm. If you're working, you put it yeah. around your head, around your <laughs> neck, keeps you cool. That's amazing. That's really great. Thank you so much for sharing this. No and problem. best of luck to you. We'll talk again. Thank you, so Thank much. you, Clay. Have a good one. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Rhonda and Carmen from Master Halco Fencing. How are you, ladies? Good. Very How are well you? And you? I'm good, thank you. So far at this expo, how has the reception been for you? It's been pretty busy off and on. Um, we've had a lot of interest in our temporary fence panels and some privacy slatting. Um, overall, it's been well received. Yeah. Can you tell me a bit about your products just because I want our viewers to learn what your company is? We are a fencing wholesale manufacturer located here in Port Kells. Um, we manufacture all our chain link on site and we also uh, import a lot of products. So PVC fencing, ornamental fencing, agricultural, so we kind of, we cover all the bases there. Okay, so it's not a retail operation, it's more of a wholesale? It is a wholesale. Wholesale only, okay, great. And how many years have you been in business? I've been with the company for 14 years, okay. but we have been in business for over 30. So lots of experience and lots of innovation, I'm guessing. Yes. Yeah, that's great. Thank you so much. Have a great day, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. So much. Thank you. Hi, I'm here at the Construction Expo with Bill from Duraflow. Bill, how are you? Excellent. Yourself? I'm doing well, thank you. Tell me, how has the reception been so far at this construction expo? Uh, you know, traffic's been good. I mean, obviously, look outside, and uh, we haven't had the nicest, hottest weekend we've had so far of the year, so that probably doesn't help. But you know what? I mean, uh, it's Sunday afternoon now, and uh, I think you know, people have finished their afternoon lunch or brunch, so yeah, they're coming in and having a walk around, for sure. It's a very nice expo and lots of great exhibits, so tell me about your exhibit. Tell me about your product. So uh, we're for a company called Camplas. Uh, so basically, we're into about four different uh, product groups. So we do a lot of uh, plumbing uh, um, uh, business. So we make a lot of different uh, fittings for plumbing, uh, okay. supplies, something like that. Yeah. Uh, we also have a commercial grease interceptor business. We do the built-in uh, vac fittings for new home construction, okay. and I represent the uh, the ventilation line for the roofing products. So very good. So who are your customers then? Is it uh, retail or is it wholesale? Uh, you know what, we, we, uh, we obviously we sell to uh, basically all the major roofing distributors uh, in, across, across Canada, oh, okay. but so, uh, so we don't sell direct to the public. But, but eventually uh, they do become your customers. They do, and so, but we like to talk to, let's say, roofing suppliers, uh, builders, roofers, uh, architects, specifiers, those are the people we sort of tend to want to talk to, right? right. So. Okay, thank you so much, Bill, and best of luck with the expo. Great. Thank you. I'm here with Chris from ABS and Co. Chris, how are you? Um, I'm fantastic. How about yourself? I'm doing well, thank you. How's the expo going so far for you? Expo has been doing fantastic. We really like here. Mm -hmm. So tell me about ABS and Co. Right, our company is based in Hong Kong. Our manufacturing and, uh, and our factory is based in Guangzhou. So we take, uh, we essentially we manufacture anything that's uh, essential to build a house, commercial buildings or uh, private houses. We take all the specification from our clients and all the measurements and all the customizations, and then we manufacture for our clients. And then we're going to ship everything out to uh, North America, and then the clients will receive from uh, from the port. Mm -hmm. So what is the benefit to the consumer dealing with your company rather than a different company? What's the advantage? Because we uh, simplify our business, uh, we're going to charge like way cheaper than all our competitors over here. Essentially, we are charging roughly about a third of what our competitors would have charged over here based on the feedback from our clients over here and all the people we talked to the past few days. So like you're paying 100% less than half what you would have paid over here. That sounds like a good deal. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much for talking to us today. Is there anything you want our viewers to know before I take off here? Anything special? Mm. Vancouver and BC has been very awesome and we're really glad that we make the trip from Hong Kong all the way here. Thank you so much.
Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Tom Dooley from Small Planet Supply and Andrew Luck from Small Planet Supply and Sega. So how are you guys doing today? We're well, thank you. You're good? How is the expo so far as far as uh, reception about your company and your products? It's, it's great, lots of interest, lots of people just seeing new products, what's out there. So it's a good, good audience. Small Planet Supply, that's the company that you're with, Tom. Can you tell me about your company? Yes, uh, we supply uh, high-performance passive host materials for the, the passive host industry, uh, air barriers, weather barriers. We also supply uh, heat recovery ventilators from Zender. Okay. And uh, we also put training classes on and workshops to uh, show people how to use the material and, and provide any services that we can that, that we can help them with. So to educate them on how to become more efficient than with those products, yeah. And what did you want to add to it, Andrew? Because I know that you were talking about this starting back in Germany, you were saying? Yes, so uh, it's, it's, this is for all the like, high-performance products uh, for passive house, yeah. high-performance building envelope. Um, so it's, it's originated back in 19... Uh, company been existing for 1950... for 52 years now. Yeah. Wow. And it's... Uh, it's with Stepco coming into this market, it's air tightness has become really important. Yes. And what we did was bring our 52 years experience over to this market and help help local builders with, with the adaptation of the code Very and good. how how they can build a better building. Yeah, that's definitely the focus nowadays is you know making more everything more green and more efficient and that's definitely the the way of the future for sure. Yeah. So anything you want to add before we go here? Talk to our viewers about anything specific you want them to know. Either of you. Just uh, come to Small Planet and mm. visit us. We'll give you a discount on your first order. And Discount's good, yeah, Tom. Yeah. Uh, where, where is Small Planet uh, so that they can come and find you? We are at Unit 105-334 East Kent Avenue in Vancouver. In Vancouver. But okay. we can also deliver anywhere in Canada. Yeah. We have an online store as well. Oh, online's big. Okay, so your, your reach is all over North America then. And yeah. We have an office in the U.S. Okay. in Washington State you too. as well. Wow, okay, great to talk to you both. Right. Have a great day and good luck at the expo. Yeah. Thanks, Thank bye. I am here at the Construction Expo with Karn Beer and Vishal from Cora. How are you guys doing today? Pretty good. good. Yeah, good. Very good. How do you feel about the exposure that you're getting with this Construction Expo? It's quite good. We meet lots of people over here, like lots of people over here. Yeah. So tell me about Cora. What is Cora and what do you want our viewers to know about your company? Uh, Cora is a very good company and uh, Cora meets all the electronic products. Uh, it is a, a huge business. Yeah. yeah, we are like mainly focusing on LED stuff like new panel lights, new step lights, bulbs and light fixtures. We are also introducing like the electrical boxes, plugs okay. and that kind of stuff. Like we are main, like our main manufacturer in the, in the China and we import the stuff from there. Okay. We sell in Calgary, Richmond. Uh, Albus Ford in Surrey, yeah. Wow, so you're, you've got a few different locations then. Yeah. It's retail and wholesale then? Yeah, some of our locations do retail. Like most of them, they are wholesalers, but some of them, they are doing the retail also. Okay. Yeah. And how long have you been in business? Around 10 years. Ten we are years. in the business, yeah. 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 Okay, so good luck to you with this expo. Is there anything else you want to let our viewers know before we go? Yeah, that's, that's how everything should be. That's, that's everything? Yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Aliyah at the Construction Expo and she's one of the people visiting here today. Aliyah, what's your experience so far with the Expo? Um, so far so good. There's been lots of vendors, lots of different people to talk to and network with and yeah, it's been fun so far. Yeah, it's a really good group of people. A lot of information, a lot of technology that they're sharing. Yeah, I've yeah. a lot of, a, a lot of uh, new experiences today and just different businesses and different people from all sorts. So. Yeah, yeah, it's great exposure. Thank you so much for talking with us today, Leah. No problem. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Okay. Thanks. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Chris uh, from James Hardy. Chris, how are you? Very good. Thank you. Very good. How far, how has the exposure been thus far at this event? You know, exposure has been great. A lot of single family home builders, as okay. well as people who are looking for consultation who are building their own house. So that's always been good for us. Can you tell me about James Hardy, just so our viewers know what your business is? So James Hardy is a fiber cement siding that would go on the exterior of your house, um, kind of weather protectant and aesthetic. And are you a wholesaler or can you tell me about that part of your company? Wholesaler, it is all business to business. So we sell direct to the lumber yards and you can buy our product at essentially any lumber yard here in North America. So you're promoting your product today here at the event? Absolutely, yes. Thank you so much for joining us today. No problem. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. 
I'm here at the Construction Expo with Michelle from Fortis BC. Michelle, how are you? Great, how are you? I'm doing very well. How is the expo going so far? It's going great. Uh, we're here, um, we have a joint booth with, uh, so it's Fortis BC, Kingdom Morgan Canada, BC One Call, and BC Common Ground Alliance. And what we want uh, people to know is that it's, we want them to be safe and okay. we want them to place uh, BC One Call before they uh, do any excavation work. So what is BC One Call? Can you explain to people that don't know, our viewers might not have an idea of what that is, if you can explain that. Sure, so BC One Call, it's a, it's a central clearinghouse. If anybody's doing any excavation work, yeah. they call them, and then BC One Call, on behalf of people, of companies who are members, okay. who have anything underground, yeah. they contact them, and then we provide information to them about what's underground before they do any work. So is it a safety issue of why they would call you? Like, everybody has to call you? It's a safety issue. Yeah. We want people to be safe because if you're doing any digging, any ground disturbance, you might, um, and if you don't know what's below, yes. you might hit it and you don't want that to happen. Okay, so the number to call then is? The number to call is 1-800-474-6886 or you can click before you dig, which is bc1call.ca. Very good. Thank you so much, Michelle. Is there anything else you want to let our viewers know before we go? Oh, I lost it. <laughs> Maybe just call before you oh, dig. Yes, okay, for sure, yes. Okay. Um, so, what, uh, let me just think. Uh, yeah. Don't forget to call or click before you dig if you're doing any excavation work. Perfect. Okay. Thank you so much. Great talking to you. Thank okay, you. Thank Bye. You. We are here at the Construction Expo with Choate Building Solutions Incorporated. We've got the whole family here. It's a family-owned business. We've got Sonia to tell us how the expo is going so far. Sonia? It's been a great learning experience. We've actually been mingling with a lot of people and getting to know other businesses and hopefully we can all work together and just be promote each other. Yeah, it's a really nice thing that all of the businesses are kind of working in tandem to promote a lot of support. Yeah. And Balvir, how has it been for you so far? It's very good experience. Yeah. It's very good response to too many people. They came, they asked hopefully we can be gonna build more clients. Yes. They took our information. Yeah. Can you tell me a bit about your business, uh, maybe what city you're located in, who you service, that type of thing? We are in rental business before like the last 20 years. Okay. Last December we had up uh, like a building material and equipment to rental. Right. So, so far we've been doing very good, uh, very good response in one year. Very good. And what location are you in? We're located in Richmond and we service all of the lower mainland in okay. BC, so call us if you need us. Right? So all of, all of the lower mainland then, yes. but you're located in Richmond? Okay, perfect. And uh, anything exciting at the exhibit so far for you, Ankush? It's everything is good. We we got to know a lot of people, yeah. a lot of new faces. So yeah. we talk to them and we explain what we are. Lots of people doesn't know our name because we just started. started. Yeah. started yeah. And it's it's people are happy to see us because we are doing a good good deals and all the stuff, right? That's wonderful. Well, you all have a great energy, and it's really nice to see the whole family, you know, together supporting the business. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so we're here at the Construction Expo and I'm here with Dave Randall from Mape. And Mape is a company that is an Italian based name, but it's to do with chemical products for building and maybe maybe Dave can tell us a bit more about it since he's the expert on this. Dave. Okay, so we are an uh, Italian company. We're based out of Milan, Italy, globally. Uh, we do have local manufacturing facilities throughout North America as well. Um, we manufacture 15 different product lines. In North America, we have roughly nine product lines, so we've pared it down a bit. We're ever expanding, uh, taking products from, from Europe and, and bringing them to North America. Uh, so we're best known for our tile and stone and floor covering uh, products, uh, but we're also uh, rapidly expanding into our concrete restoration materials as well. We have a tunneling division, we have a sports flooring division, uh, wood flooring division, uh, resinous flooring division so our, our product lines are like I said ever ever expanding and growing uh, we have a local manufacturing facility here in Delta okay yeah um, and we have representation sales representation all across Canada okay. every province yeah okay and how is it going at the construction expo for you today oh it's great yeah the uh, the traffic coming in is wonderful we've got lots of great uh, interesting questions so uh, yeah it's going very well is this your first year doing this or no we were here last year as well yeah okay. Yeah. Well, good to speak to you. Okay. Have a great day and good luck to you. Thank you so okay. much. You. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Sukbir and Gurmil from Opal Building Supplies. And they are here to talk about their business and let us know how the expo is going this morning. Gurmil. Yeah. 
Uh, this is our uh, first time here and um, we are enjoying very much. There's a very good response here. Uh, we are in a building uh, industry uh, selling all sorts of product uh, from insulation to all sorts of uh, exterior products such as Hardy, uh, James Hardy, uh, Allura, vinyl siding, uh, gutters, uh, um, even the sump pumps, you know. So we have wide variety of uh, products available and we are located in Surrey on uh, 78 and uh, 128 Street. Um, for uh, any of uh, you know the customer uh, needs, please come and visit us there. And um, once again, it's a very nice event. That's wonderful. How is the morning going so far for you? Uh, we have been very busy. Uh, people, uh, we have some new pro launched some new products, and uh, we are getting very good response. Very good. Thank you so much. Have a great afternoon. Thank good luck to you. Much. Thank have you. Bye bye. I'm here at the Construction Expo with John Alley. He's from Custom Building Products. John, how is this morning going for you? It's been a fantastic show thus far. Yeah. Yeah. Can you tell me a bit about your business? We're a, a local manufacturer that makes setting materials for tile and stone installation as well as self-leveling compounds, anti-fracture membranes and moisture mitigation. So that's kind of the products that they have in like big retail stores? Absolutely. So like mortar and that kind of stuff? Yep, the thin sets, the grouts, the mortars, anything to set natural stone both interior and exterior. Very good. And you're located? We have a location in Surrey, but our distributors are based throughout all of Canada and the U.S. So it's not actually a um, customer to business, it's kind of business to business? Absolutely. Okay, great. And uh, so the reception today has been how so far? It's been fantastic thus far. It's um, been incredibly busy. We've been able to touch base with a lot of clients that we generally don't get to, to speak to. Okay, well, have a great day and good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Chad Chuby from Plytex Stairs. Chad, how are you this morning? I'm well, thank you. Good. You're getting good reception with all the people here today? Very good so far. Yeah. Can you tell me what your business is all about? We are a stair and railing manufacturing company, and we primarily uh, uh, build construction grade stairs, and we do the custom treads and railings for that. Okay, and I saw behind me it says Plylam. What does Plylam mean? Yeah. Plylam is our stair stringer product. We, we manufacture Plylam for stair stringers and it's to eliminate uh, dimensional lumber from stairs and it'll eliminate uh, cracking, twisting, warping and all, all that kind of stuff and future shrinking and squeaking in the, in the houses. So it's a more durable product then? Very. Wow, very cool. What's this at the bottom here? This part here. These here are tread caps. They're made out of solid oak. Okay. Yeah, so we, we can uh, cover your stair after it's built with that. Yeah. Very cool. Good to talk to you and good luck with this event. Awesome. Yeah, thank, thank you so much. much. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Sergeet Sidhu of Rocky Mountain Stone. Sergeet, how's it going this morning? Very good, Sonia. How are you? I'm doing very well. This is quite impressive. You say that you're locally based and uh, this Rocky Mountain Stone has been around for how many years? Around 40 years, yeah. And can you tell us a bit about your business, what you do? Yeah, what we do is uh, we do all wet casting, we make uh, uh, concrete fencings and uh, our stone-based, like stone-faced retaining wall systems and plus we do the stone veneer. So we just introduced another uh, product like uh, almost three years back called Cloud Stone. It's ultra lightweight, especially for the end users, do it in your self-style rock so people can cut it easily, they can install it easily. Okay. So we do all that in-house production. So everything is made at our plant based in Alder Grove. So your plant is based locally in Alder Grove. And this stuff looks like the real thing, but it's actually synthetic. Uh, no, it's not synthetic, it's a concrete. Oh, it is so concrete. It is concrete. So, so it's man-made. Man yeah. It's very cool. From natural rock, so you get same authentic look with the variety of different colors. It's amazing. Thank you so much, and good luck to you. Thank yeah, you. thank you. Hanji, I see major kang dinala the gal kardeya. MK Cedar Fencing ina the business danoya. Major ji, thar the business baare tosi sanu thoda jada dasso, ha? Thar singe nami vinyl fencing nami leke ayi. Hanji. No paint need, no maintenance need, just one time. So, I don't have any fancy, I don't have any paint, I don't have any paint, I don't have any paint, I don't have any paint. It's a big deal. So, how many years have you been in this business? 15 years. 15 years have you been? Very good. So, where is your office? I'm doing the office. I'm doing the office. I'm doing the office. 148, 87. 148, okay. So, where are you from? So, where are your customers? Where are you from? I'm doing the office. So maybe Surrey area, Langley area, Cloverdale, sorry. Very good. Do you see where you are from? Vancouver? Very good. Okay. Very happy to be here. Good luck to you. Okay, thank you. 
I'm here at the Construction Expo with Jazz King, and she's with Century 21. Jazz, how are you this morning? I'm great, thank you. Good. So you're a realtor here in the Lower Mainland? Yes, I do uh, cover Surrey, Cloverdale, Langley, and uh, South Surrey. Very good. How many years have you been a realtor here? I've been doing since 2006, so this is my 11th year. It's a pretty hot market right now. Everything I see a sold sign, like everywhere I go, it's a pretty good market. It's a pretty good market as long as you price it right. So things get sell faster, but if you price it above the market, obviously that stays in the market for sometimes. Okay, and I know this is kind of just impromptu. Do you have any kind of a tip that you would tell somebody selling their home, maybe the one thing that they should kind of do before they call you? I would say tidy up your home, stage it, and uh, make it freshen up a little bit. If, if it needs a little bit of paint job, get that done so that it, when the buyer comes in, they feel welcoming. Absolutely. It goes a long way, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you so much, Jazz. Thank you. All right. Good luck to you. Thank you. Bye-bye. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Sayeda Sif and Amrit from SNS Insurance Service. How are you boys doing today? Yeah, we are good. Okay. Fine. We're doing really good. Actually, uh, came here today a little bit earlier, and so far, uh, it's been going really great. So can you tell me a bit about your business, something you'd want our viewers to know about your business? Well, we're basically, uh, we're, we do mainly in uh, our main uh, circle of businesses in Vancouver. We focus uh, strictly on well, personal lines and commercial lines, which is more like a home-based insurance. And then uh, we do a lot of construction insurance as well. And we, and we can do business anywhere in BC and Alberta. Very good. And how is the reception today with the people? It's uh, uh, very, uh, actually it's very fantastic. It's awesome. So many people coming here and asking our business over there. And uh, actually we, we do the home insurance, business insurance and the car insurance as well. Okay. And we have one, uh, one location in the Vancouver okay. and one in the Delta as well, inside the Superstore. Perfect. So you guys are available for anybody on this side as well? Yeah, anytime. That's very good. Thank you so much and good luck to you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Dave LeCaplin from KM Roberts. Dave, how are you this morning? Doing great. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Can you tell me a bit about KM Roberts and Associates Limited? Yeah, we're a sales agency. We've been around since 1976 and we specialize mostly in electrical and mechanical products in BC and Western Canada. Okay. How is it going at the Expo today? It's been great. Everyone's been friendly and liking to see some of the new products we brought. So if you want our viewers to see something out of your new products, what is something that you'd want our viewers to just kind of learn about in a quick, just a quick couple words? We got floor heating for a nice uh, warm feel in the tile in your bathroom. Got some ventilation to keep your bathroom from molding and some great lighting to spruce things up and look uh, bright. That's very good. I like the warm uh, tile because in the winter it's awful when you get out there and it's just freezing cold first thing in the morning. It wakes you up though, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. for sure. Turns your bathroom into a spa. I like that. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Dave. Good to meet you. you. you good too. luck. Thank thanks. Hanji Bilal Mahmoodji, how are you today? I'm good. Thank you very much. Good. What's your business name? UDC Designs. Business name is Basically, UDC Design means Urban Design Center. We are architects and interior designers. And uh, uh, we do residential commercial buildings. Yeah. How many years have you been here? Around 25 years now. Where do you work in the area? Where do you work in the area? Where do you work in the area? Most, uh, all, over the, uh, all over BC. And we, are, we do international projects too. Okay. But rightly, uh, presently we are working in Vancouver. Okay. And uh, all over BC. So if you have a small share, you can do your services in the area. You can go there. Anywhere. Very good. Very good to meet you. The Jada Expo is starting. How are you feeling? The reception is so far. So far, so good. Very good. How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? My son is just getting training now. Yeah. Hmm, getting it for you. Yeah. Very good. What is your name, young man? Daniel. Daniel? Yeah. Very good to meet you, Daniel. That's nice that you're helping your dad, Bilalji. It's very nice to meet you. Nice okay. Nice to meet you too. Thank, Thank you so much for coming. Have a good day. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Sandeep Manget from WorkSafe BC. How are you today? I'm doing good, thank you. How was the reception so far with the Expo? It was wonderful. I just came out of a seminar. It was well attended, good questions, good interest. I love that. That's wonderful. WorkSafe BC is amazing because it's giving information to all of, the, all of our viewers, actually. So I saw something on asbestos. I thought that some, asbestos was uh, prior to 1980, but I heard from one of your WorkSafe agents that it's actually 1993. Yeah, can you elaborate on that? Yeah, so really, you know, homes between 1950s to the 1990s, yes. there was a lot of material, almost over 3,000 materials that had asbestos containing. 
stuff in it. So it's, uh, anyway, you're right. If you're saying 1980s or 1990s, that's right. Yeah. So basically, that material has a lot of asbestos. Asbestos is a mineral fiber. Uh, very, very dangerous when it's airborne. So what's happening is when people are renovating or they're rebuilding and they're demolishing, that's when it gets airborne. If you're not taking the proper measures, it can get into your lungs as a result of breathing it in. Once it's in, it kind of settles in as a fish hook, yeah. scars the lung tissue, and there's no cure. So I guess precautions for uh, these types of uh, actions, I guess when you're doing something in a house, you've got like, I guess, masks and that type of thing. Is that on your website? Yes, respirators. You need to be wearing and donning the right kind of respirators. Make sure before you demolish or renovate a home, you get an asbestos checkout done, that it's, it's, there's, no, there's no asbestos containing material in there. If you find that, remove that. There are asbestos abatement contractors that will do it right, wear the right personal protective equipment. Once that asbestos material is out, get a clearance, and then you're good to demolish the home. Then it's all good. Right. It's always good to be safe with these things. Thank you so much. It's such a pleasure to talk to you. We'll talk again. Thank you, Sonia. I appreciate it. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Chris Smith of Flextile. Chris, how are you this morning? Uh, really good. How are you? I'm good. How has the expo gone so far? Uh, it's, it started off a little slow, but it's really picking up now. And um, we're seeing a lot of uh, customers, a lot of businesses coming in. So it's uh, so far so good. What can you tell me about Flextile Limited? What kind of business is this? Uh, so we are an installation uh, solutions manufacturer. We're the only Canadian manufacturer, Canadian-owned company in this industry. So we do uh, under hard surface products. So underneath tiles, we manufacture um, and produce all those products. Very good. And uh, you're here again tomorrow? Yes. Very good. Have you done this in previous years? No, my first year. Good. And yeah. you like it so far? So far, so good. Very yeah. Good. Nice to speak with you. Thank you so much. Okay, thanks. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Alexis from the City of Surrey. Alexis, can you tell me about your exhibit? We are from the Planning Department um, in the tree section. So we protect trees during construction. And so we thought the Construction Expo would be a good place for us to, to have a presence and talk a little bit about why we protect trees during construction, um, how we do that, and what the requirements might be if you're building in Surrey. Okay, so a lot of these uh, people that are attending today are learning uh, about preserving Mother Nature, I guess, then. Yeah, as best yeah. we can. We have to balance it with development as well, um, and we definitely understand that with the City of Surrey, but there are things that, that, yeah, that need to be done to protect them. Well, it's very good to see you at this expo. It's uh, everybody else's construction stuff, so this is very nice to see this as well. Thank you so much, Alexis. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Bill from Loss Prevention Fasteners. Bill, how are you today? Oh, I'm having a great time. Fantastic show. Very good. And I'm also here with Rianne Brown, also from Loss Prevention Fasters. Hi there. Okay, so tell me about this business. This is very exciting. Yeah, uh, Loss Prevention Fasters, we supply uh, anti-theft, uh, tamper-resistant, and high-security screws, nuts, and bolts. Uh, this, these fasteners uh, require special tools uh, to install and remove the, uh, the fasteners. So if you have railings, gates, proprietary technology, and you don't want the general public to either investigate or take away, you're going to use my anti-theft fasteners. That's amazing. So you're located in the Lower Mainland here? Yeah, we're in Surrey. Our head office is in Surrey. We've uh, sold 44 countries around the world. Uh, we're the largest uh, online uh, manufacturer and distributor in North America. That's wonderful. And how is the reception here at the Expo today? How are the people? You know, it's a, we're getting out of it exactly what we wanted to get. We're bringing brand awareness, we're bringing solutions, and we're, and we're uh, enabling some companies to uh, come up with ideas to add uh, fastener uh, upgrades. You've bought my railings from me, now maybe you should investigate in going with a high security fastener package. So, Very good, so maybe it's almost like a business to business as well. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah, most of our business is business to business, but we do cater to uh, to uh, end users, homeowners, uh, and anybody that uh, just needs a solution. Uh, we're happy to uh, help anybody, any business, any size. It's very cool. Good to meet you, Thank and you. good luck to you both. Thank you so much. We're here at the Construction Expo with Kevin Ozier from Pro Turf. Kevin, how are you? I'm excellent. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. How is the reception so far at the expo today? Uh, I love it. Uh, getting a lot of good response uh, from everybody. Uh, seems like people are really interested in artificial turf. It's really taken off. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm having a great show here. So this pro turf, I find it very exciting because when I walked up to you, I thought it was legit grass and I'm like, what? I can't believe it's not. It looks amazing. Thank you. Yeah, it's, uh, it's all Bella Turf uh, product, number one supplier in Canada, full 10-year warranty on uh, 
on all their turf. Uh, it, uh, it's the best of the best. There's a two-tone blade and a two-tone curly thatch down inside it. makes it look really uh, realistic and uh, super strong, durable stuff. Could you imagine never having to mow your lawn again? I mean, that's pretty awesome. Yeah, I, you know, I tell people, sell your lawnmower, get a leaf blower and blow the leaves off once in a while, and that's it. You're good to go. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. So, and you're a local company. Yeah, we're based in Surrey, uh, but, you know, we do all lower mainland. So you service all, like, say, Vancouver and... Vancouver to Chilliwack, even, even further, yeah. Yeah. And how many years have you been in this business? Um, I've been installing artificial turf for eight years. I used to install CFL FIFA fields across Canada, and I left that side of the business, that company, to start up my own thing, and I brought that installation technique and adhesive products and machine to residential installations. Um, it's, it's just the best of the best. I think it's amazing, and I'm, I'm probably going to get it, so you've got, you know, my endorsement. Yeah. <laughs> All right, have a great day, Kevin. Good to meet you. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. take care. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Scott and Darcy from SS Rig and Vac Limited. How are you doing today? Good, how are you doing? I'm good, thank you. How are you, Darcy? Very good, very good. Beautiful day today. It is beautiful, yeah. Finally, the weather is very nice. How do you find the reception at the Expo today? That's been really good, actually. So we got lots of feedback, and it's going good so far. Can you tell me a bit about what your business is? I mean, it's a bit obvious, but if you can just go into a bit of detail for our viewers. Well, we're the, we're the original equipment manufacturer for this particular type of equipment, and it's used for, for digging holes, uh, more of a municipal uh, utility exposure type tool where you can go in and not affect any uh, fiber optics, any gas lines that bring it up. The boys can, re, they can repair in a nice dry environment and then put the dirt back in the hole. Okay, so this is something that everybody at this expo would be very interested in. Correct, yeah. 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 Have a great day and good luck tomorrow as well. Thank you. Bye. I am at the Construction Expo with John Reynolds of Griff Building Products. John, how are you? I'm well today. How are you? I'm well, thank you. This is a great expo. How has it been going so far for you? Actually, it's been very, very busy. Uh, a lot of people to our booth, so it's great. Very good. I see that you actually have a specialty product that you're showcasing. You can tell us a bit about that if you'd like. Sure, love to. Um, this is a Kriner ground screw. Uh, it is uh, environmentally friendly, low impact, and it replaces the need to use concrete. So uh, anything that you'd normally think about using concrete for, the Kriner ground screw replaces it, or is an alternative. That's amazing. So if you want to fasten something like, say, a gazebo or something, you wouldn't have to do the concrete, you would just do the screw. That's correct. So, and if you wanted to put a boardwalk in uh, an environmentally sensitive area uh, that you don't want to dig big holes in and fill full of concrete, uh, the screw is an alternative. That's amazing. That's really good technology. Yeah. Thank you so much, John. Good luck to you. All right. Thanks very much. Thank you. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Asif Salim and Leo Zhang. They're from Empower Me. And they are talking about saving energy and educating people about that. Can you tell us a bit about the exhibit that you're here exhibiting? Actually, today we are here uh, for, uh, the, to display a message for uh, BC Fortress and all these light companies. Uh, that's about construction. A lot of people, they don't have awareness uh, when they do construction or excavation. Uh, they don't know and they start digging and they can damage the undergoing pipelines of different uh, uh, like talus, like BC Gas and uh, Kindergarten Morgan, sorry. So we are here to just educate them that there is a number. Uh, let me display on the other screen. Uh, that's called BC One Call for the audience who is I was uh, watching this. So you have to call this number and uh, they will uh, respond to you either through email or whatever the way is and uh, they will uh, send you a map. So you will figure out where to start. And uh, if you have problem in map, then might be they can send a representative who can mark down for you the proper place. So this is for your safety for people and. Uh, it can cost you if you damage something. It can cost you in terms of safety of people around you, your neighbors, family. So this is all message we are uh, just passing on to the communities today in this expo. Very good. And Leo, can you tell me how has the reception been with the people that are actually visiting today? Uh, so many people, they are interested about, I mean, the builder, contractor, even though the hydro. Because uh, some of them, they are familiar with this BC One Core, and uh, some of it is just the first time to hear. Uh, by the way, this BC One Core is a totally free service. Okay, it's yeah. free. Help yeah, you. yes. Thank you so much, Leo. Thank you, Asif Salim. Thank nice you. to see you. Okay, yep. okay. have a good day. Have Thank you. Day. Bye. Bye. I'm here at the Construction Expo with Bruce Ralston, the Minister of Jobs, Trade and Technology. Bruce, how are you? 
Great, great. It's great to be here. Um, this is a, an, an exciting exposition looking at new products, new technology and new trends in the construction industry. Construction is a very important part of uh, the BC economy and particularly here in south of the Fraser in Surrey. Residential and commercial construction is, uh, is a big part of what uh, provides uh, employment for people and uh, puts, puts, uh, puts roti on the table. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Very good. So what have you seen here today that you haven't seen before? Maybe that's uh, given you maybe a little bit of information on something new, maybe some new technology or something? Well, one of the interesting booths here was uh, someone from uh, the Passive House uh, Movement, which is uh, designed to make houses more airtight, therefore increase their efficiency and reduce the loss of heat and, and, and in the long run you save uh, maintenance costs. So that's uh, as we move towards a low carbon economy, as we confront climate change, uh, it's great to see that uh, builders are taking up the challenge and, and the person I talked to said there's a lot of interest in that technology. Very good. It's a pleasure to speak with you today and um, enjoy the event. Great. Thanks very much. Great to be here. Thank you so much. We're here at the Construction Expo with Richard and Hardeep from Zone Garage. How are you guys? Very good, yeah. Very good. Enjoying the show. How are you doing? So your business is uh, quite amazing. This is very cool stuff we're standing on. Can you tell me a bit about your product? Absolutely. So it's a, it's a polyurea garage floor coating. Uh, it's fully resistant to oil, gas, calcium, salt, 20-year uh, warranty on adhesion and color. And it's a, it's a one-day floor coating system. So uh, we come in in the morning, grind down the floors, apply our base coat and flake, and then scrape down the surface after that's dry and apply our clear coat. Uh, the customer can walk on it four hours after we leave and drive their car back in the garage the following day. Wow, so what kind of cleanup does this entail? Uh, cleanup is a very low maintenance product. Uh, if you want, maybe once or twice a year pressure washer, but it's resistant to oils, gas, solvent, so whatever spills on it, you can just wipe it off with the rag. Seems like a very cool product and it's very popular now. Absolutely. Uh, the garage floor, uh, or garage remodels as a whole is one of the largest or the fastest growing sectors in the construction industry right now as you know, people never take into the uh, fact that you pay the same amount for a square foot in your kitchen as you do for in your garage. And it's just a, a space that people kind of push off to the side and it's where they throw all their extra stuff. But for uh, a small amount of money, somebody can really take that space and turn it into a part of their home rather than just a dumping ground for all their extra stuff. Yeah, it's a very nice product. Thank you so much. And how do you guys feel about the uh, visitors today? Are they receptive to your product? It's been great. Uh, train has been good. Uh, a lot of uh, the crowds different. We've got builders, developers, and even homeowners. So. Uh, and you service which area do you service? Uh, we service the entire province. We've got uh, nine locations here in BC. Oh, wow. uh, Hardy Pier runs uh, North Surrey, so he services this whole area. And then we've got teams throughout the entire Lower Mainland, all the way into the Okanagan and Vancouver Island. That's wonderful. Thank you, Hardeep, and thank you, Richard. Thank Good you. luck to you guys. We're here at the Construction Expo with Green Tech Resurfacing. We've got Ray and Nigel here to tell us a bit about their product. Ray? Hi, how are you doing today? I'm, I'm well. How are you? Good, thanks. Good. So if you can tell us a bit about your product and uh, maybe just tell our viewers what it is and what the benefits are of the Green Tech Resurfacing. Okay, okay. well, we, have, uh, we do uh, driveway resurfacing. Um, we're using a, a recycled material, recycled truck tires, and um, it re refurbishes and renews your driveway. Your cracked or, or, or uh, spalled driveways renews them to make them look like new again. That sounds like an awesome idea. What uh, areas do you uh, serve? We cover uh, total lower mainland of, of British Columbia, right okay. from Squamish almost to Chilliwack. Okay, yeah, this is a great alternative because the one, oftentimes the house looks nice, but the driveway doesn't, so this is a really good thing. And you can get a variety of different colors, it looks like. Totally. you got uh, the black, which is the recycled rubber mm -hmm. tires, truck tires actually, from BC. And then you've got the various colors, all the man-made synthetic rubbers. You can go from a yellow pool deck to a, a, a green sidewalk if you want. It's total up to the customer's choice. And, uh, so, it's, so it's not just driveways, you can do decks and various pool other decks, you can do walkways, patios, walkways, yeah. porches, Very good. playgrounds. Yeah. So how has the reception been with the visitors today at the expo? 
Uh, it's just been really good. Um, had some really good um, clientele coming in and uh, touched base with a lot of uh, locals. And uh, yeah, we were we're set to go in the next couple couple weeks here. And yeah, looking forward to it. So, is this a relatively new business then? Is that what you mean? No, uh, I'm I'm just saying that it's, it's a new season. Oh, I we see. do it only in the in the uh, summer season because. So you're gearing up. I get yeah. it. So you're getting ready. Very good. It's such a pleasure to meet you, and best of luck with this. It's a great idea, and it looks beautiful. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Sonia. Yeah. Thank you. I'm at the Construction Expo with Gurpreet from Cascade Bath and Lighting. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How is the expo going so far? So far, it's been busy. It's really good. Yeah. yeah. Tell me a bit about your business so our viewers can learn about Cascade. Uh, well, we are a plumbing and lighting showroom, so we have all kind of major brands from uh, Delta, Ryobel, and Kohler, and we have major brand names for sinks like LK and uh, Blanco, um, and we have a, a showroom in Langley Bypass, so people can come there, and we have a whole lot more selection on display there. So your business is business to business, or just the public can come in? Uh, it's a retail and wholesale, so people can come in, people, builders and uh, people who are building for themselves. So we have whole different packages for different kind of people, yeah. Very good. And how many years have you been in business? We've been uh, in business more than 10 years now. Very good. And what is the reception like at this event so far? How are the people liking it? Um, so far, it's been really great as compared to past years. Um, the turnaround have been uh, way better than before, and a lot more people are interested in what different kind of things are available now. So we're uh, people asking questions more yeah. this time around. Uh, last time around, people didn't really know what they're looking for, but this time around, it's like more professionals are out there. Yeah. I guess more questions around efficiency and that kind of thing, I suppose. Yeah, such a pleasure to talk to you, Gurpreet. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck.